Good morning, YouTubers, and welcome to the vlog. As you can see, I am going to go for a jog. No, I'm not. I'm going to go for a bike ride. Uh, it's been a couple weeks since I've gone for a ride. Let's just get out of the sun. Uh, so I'm all set up. I've got my water. I've got my computers. Um, I'm only going to go for half an hour. Uh, one of the things I haven't... Uh, I'm going to sit down. It's easier that way. Uh, one of the things... I uh, forgot to tell you guys, I'm doing a stress test on Thursday morning, so I'm going to ride my bike today and tomorrow so that I can make it through. It's, a, it's one of the ones where you jog for like 15 minutes straight, and it's I hate jogging, so, um, so I'm going to get on my bike today and tomorrow, build up a little bit more endurance. Uh, so I'll let you know the outcome of that. I believe I'll be fine. Uh, leading into the... Uh, recital season I always get stressed out and you start to get pains in your chest and as a 48 year old guy uh, pains in your chest uh, scare the shit out of you and um, so I talked to the doctor and he says well again let's put you out through a stress test and we'll eliminate any heart problems and we'll also give you an EKG which lets the computer know if you've actually had any type of a heart incident, heart related incident, like a heart attack, mild, whatever. Sometimes people have heart attacks, they don't even know they had a heart attack because it uh, just damages a tiny little piece of your heart and it's not uh, something that takes you out, like a full on heart attack. Anyway, so uh, I got some good news <laughs> besides my bike ride. And then I brought you down a little bit with the stress test. Uh, on September 3rd, I am collaborating with JP. Uh, he has an awesome YouTube channel called Healthy Junk Food, and it's H-E-L-L, the junk food. And uh, so I just talked with him yesterday. I've been talking to him for a while. Uh, him and Dame hooked up. He's part of the, the um, Team Dame Food Network. <laughs> So, uh, so we, he lives in central New York, and I live obviously in central Ontario, Canada. So the best, our best location is, I think I talked to you about this yesterday. Again, vlogging from day to day, you forget sometimes of the things you talk about. Anyway, so there's, there's the gray boy. Look at that, he wants to party. Anyway, so I'm gonna go for just a half an hour, and uh, then I'll be back and I'll let you know what my uh, calorie burn was all oh, attack. Nope. That was very uneventful. No drama. Okay, I'll be back in a half an hour. And we're back. So that was a 50 minute bike ride. And it looks like I burned uh, 1,045. Whether that's accurate or not, it's good enough for me. Let me tell you. Uh, it's nice, perfect temperature to go for a ride today. Uh, slight winds. I didn't push any uh, speed limits or try to break any speed records today. Um, if I move it over one or up one more, like I only average like 26.6 kilometers an hour, which is it's definitely slower than normal. Uh, now I usually stretch for about six minutes. Uh, usually my calves, my hams, and then my quads. And I do uh, 30 second stretches each. And the cat's gonna kill something over there. All right, so it's time to relax, cool down, have some breakfast. Uh, before I went for my ride, I had a banana. Uh, I think one time before I mentioned about the fact that you shouldn't eat before you go for a bike ride. That was incorrect. You're supposed to have something small to give some energy to your body, uh, but you don't eat like a huge thing of bacon and eggs and then go for a bike ride. Nah, that's not a good idea, especially greasy bacon. Yeah. Hey guys, I am heading down to Bradford to do Friday's food video, which is the pretzel bun uh, cheeseburger and the pretzel bun chicken pup. And it's gonna be uh, Versus. So I've done each of those reviews, and I'm gonna actually do uh, Versus. So the burger versus the chicken, and uh, so that will go up Friday, but I need to shoot it now and get it done. Uh, I guess luckily, Ben is working Friday and Saturday. 
So we were supposed to go up to the cottage Thursday, but because Ben's working, we can't go up until Saturday. And I'm hoping it's a day shift he has on the Saturday. That way we can go up for Saturday night. And then we're gonna be up at the cottage for a whole week. So you're gonna get a lot of short little, not necessarily short vlogs, but the quality of the vlog is gonna diminish unless I can go into town once or twice uh, during the holiday and upload from a library or wherever that has free Wi-Fi. I guess it's the, there's a McDonald's in Bracebridge, Ontario that has Wi-Fi, free Wi-Fi. So, but it's like 20 kilometers away. And I don't wanna have to drive 20 kilometers just to upload a, a daily vlog. So what I'll do, I guess, is I'll have to uh, just do a, a quick vlog off my phone down by the dock while having a beer or something like that. And uh, I'm just hoping this wind isn't affecting this camera. Let's do up those windows. There we go. So it's really hot today, guys. Woo! In the car, it's hot. Outside, it's nice. In the car, it's really hot. So I'm just gonna turn everything up. All right, so uh, I, like I said, I'm heading down to Bradford. Everything's good. Uh, I've got my stuff, whoops, I've got my stuff all ready to go. I just finished editing uh, tonight's video, which is the subway, I, I'm calling it the Eight Balls of Wonder. Mr. Er, Mr. Sub. Eight Balls of Wonder subway meatball sub video review thing. And then next, and then I have to do a bunch of food reviews as fast as I can. Like I'm gonna have to go out tomorrow and Thursday and so that you guys have a Tuesday next week and then next Friday all set up and ready to go. We'll be back Sunday, so I'll probably have time or while I'm in uh, Bracebridge or somewhere out there, I'll do a food review and then you can have a food review. Maybe I'll do one from um, Port Carling and one from Bracebridge. That will be two good food reviews. I'll try and find something local. I actually have two in mind right now. Nice. And we're back. I just wanted to give you guys an update on my Skype. Uh, because my Skype is Ken Domic, uh, no upper case letters and no spaces, um, everybody's finding Ken on Skype, which is fine. It doesn't bother me, but don't try and video call me. Uh, everybody wants to video call me and I, I basically, and it's funny, some people instantly get it. Oh, okay, I understand, no problem. You can ask me questions on Skype. I might answer them within two seconds. I might answer them within a month because I get a lot of questions on my Skype. Uh, but you're more than welcome to, I'll, um, I guess, befriend me on Skype. I will accept your invitation. And, but don't try and video call me because I will not answer. But like I said, in for the Kickstarter, that's gonna be actually a uh, reward. It's gonna be uh, a one hour conversation. I'm not sure exactly what tier level that's gonna be at. Possibly the hundred level, hundred dollar level, but I'll, I'll go through those with you as I set up my fundraiser. Uh, it's not a fundraiser, it's a Kickstarter. So, um, it is a fundraiser, isn't it? It's called a crowd something. Crowdfunding, that's it. I can't believe I remembered. So crowdfunding, uh, if anybody knows anything about the fact that, you know, I go, I say, you know, Kickstarter Canada, type it in, it takes me to Kickstarter Canada. Start up the whole thing and then it won't let me enter my address because it's only giving me an American address. And so I skip that step and I do tons of other work on this thing and I go into my, uh, into the next thing where they want me to start an Amazon.com which is different than shopping. There's an Amazon shopping thing and then there's an Amazon collecting money. So I go there and the only three countries that it accepts is like the uh, United States, Basically, I don't know what the other two are. It's like, I think it's England and one other, but Canada is not on there. So if that's the only method of payment that I can receive from, why is it saying that I can be, ugh, I hate when, th when, when websites do that kind of stuff. It drives me nuts. It's like, oh yeah, here's the Canadian site. So you start doing it, oh, no, you're not. 
Canada, Canadians aren't, aren't allowed. But I know a guy from Montreal who did it, and I don't know how he did it. Uh, so I'm gonna have to give him a call. Anyway, can rage. <laughs> Just finished up at Wendy's, uh, and then I went to um, <clears throat> just finished up at Wendy's and, uh, and then I went to Shopper's Drug Mart to find chips. There's like certain Lay's chips. There are certain Lay's chips now. I'm at Sobeys uh, looking for these Lay's chips. Uh, I also wanted to tell you that these Wendy's is launching their smoked Gouda chicken on brioche bread so go check that out it's on my Instagram can't wait till that's out let's see if they have it here chips 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 I don't and I didn't want to get the big bags that would be an expensive review so they have smoky bacon but it's not the ones so finally I found a store that has it it is uh, Sobeys it says try all four and they've got jalapeno mac and cheese uh, cinnamon bun uh, tzatziki, I think that's what it says, tzatziki, and uh, bacon poutine. I think bacon poutine is going to win. So let's get one of each. All right, just finished up at Sobeys, and that cost $13.51 for four bags of chips. Well, as you can see, I have two bags of ice. Uh, I am going to be doing the ice bucket challenge for ALS, and of course that will go on my main channel, and it should go up. I think I'll put it up tomorrow. Uh, it is possible I'll spring it on you guys tonight, but I think it'll interfere with my um, subway video. I couldn't think of it at the second. You know what I'm saying? All right, so I'll be home in a minute and we will shoot the ice bucket challenge. All right, guys, that's all I have for you today. Sam wanted to be in this one. Say hi. He does want to say hi. Uh, I just finished cooking pierogies for Ben. Megan made me pizza pockets earlier. So, uh, yeah, we're all done. We're all good. There's the chips for review very soon coming up for you. I just released my uh, Subway video. It's doing really well. And, of course, I did the LS, as you guys probably already know. you probably already seen it. It's on my main channel. Uh, you'll have to see how I react to that one. All right, guys. Thanks for all the thumbs up. Ding, 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 ding. And we'll talk to you tomorrow. Have a great evening. Bye.